Hey YouTube, this is Blueberry7497 and I'm back with another tech video. Um, in this video we're going to be taking a quick look at some of the difference, or some of the things um, in Signage Mod 10. Uh, this is the Experimental M2 or the I believe it stands for the monthly uh, release, the second one. The uh, It's supposed to be more stable than, than the nightlies. Um, so I'm just going to be given a few minutes to talk about how the performance is and um, maybe some bugs that, that are uh, in it. Um, first off, I'd just like to preface this by saying uh, sorry for my um, my possibly weird sounding uh, voice. I'm uh, not feeling too well. Um, but uh, so anyway, um, I'll go ahead and show you uh, that this is on the uh, Experimental M2 build. Um, so it is based on, uh, I'm guessing, Android 4.1.2 since that's what the uh, Android version is. Just in case you're wondering, the Easter egg is still the same since it's based on Android 4.1. Um, the kernel version, um, that is, uh, I guess, Wednesday, October 10th. Um, signage, mod, signage mod version right there. I know it's kind of hard, it might be kind of hard to see. Uh, it says October uh, 2012, um, the 11th Experimental M2 right there. Um, so, uh, Science and Mod, uh, I really like their, their ROM, uh, up to this point, it's been relatively, uh, it's been pretty good, um, I wouldn't say, um, I wouldn't say bugless, um, I have had some bugs, uh, for example, I don't know if, uh, you know, if it'll actually pop up, you know how bugs work when you try to get them on camera, it's it, kind of hard, um, but if I can get my power button to work here. When I try to turn off uh, my device at times, let's see, um, if I power it off and I'll let it go through and uh, uh, what it's supposed to do is just power off, you know, and what happens though is, okay, so as I'm talking about it, it doesn't do it, um, <clears throat> but there are times when I turn it off and I don't know if um, any of you Signage Mod 10 users on your Nexus S are experienced this, but when I turn it off, um, it gets stuck at that, if you saw that, how that little wheel or uh, circle kind of uh, spins around it gets stuck right there and um, I have to just take out the battery because uh, there's nothing I can do I can't back out of it or anything it just gets stuck um, another um, another bug is I do have random reboots um, this happens if my CPU is clocked at regular um, it's on the uh, I believe it's the governor um, is uh, uh, on interactive and my clock speed is between 200 megahertz and 1 gigahertz so I'm not overclocking and I'm just leaving it how it is um, for example uh, a few minutes ago I was actually I was on a phone call and the phone cut out and I had to see what was going on and I noticed this boot screen so the phone just reboot when I was on the phone um, now it might be uh, I don't really have um, a lot of apps that I that aren't trusted installed so it, I don't think it's any rogue apps that could be causing that reboot um, I will go ahead and, and check it out though and see if that's the problem um, and uh, it does also happen though that random reboots are more um, I have noticed in my experience are more likely if you have it overclocked to 1.2 gigahertz uh, or higher um, if I if I have it overclocked to 1.2 gigahertz, I'll get anywhere between two and four random reboots in a in a given day, and those mostly happen when the screen is off. So if I have it uh, overclocked to 1.2 gigahertz, the screen it's off, it's either charging or not, and I go to wake the screen, it'll kind of freeze, it, it won't wake, and you'll just see the the spinning logo. So that's another thing, um, you know. Uh, that you have to be uh, cautious of, but overclocking itself, it's not just exclusive to Signage and Mod. Um, I'm sure if you overclock on, on any ROM, uh, you will experience stability issues. Um, other than that, though, I mean, uh, the ROM has been pretty stable. There's nothing uh, super uh, or, you know, just really wrong with it. Um, and I really do like it. I've tried AOKP, um, and I don't, um, you know, no. No offense to AOKP, um, I think their ROMs, uh, I, I applaud them for making custom ROMs, um, but I do like CyanogenMod Mod uh, better in my, uh, in my, for my use. Um, if you can see the general settings, idle stats has been something that hasn't worked and um, since the very beginning of me making these videos, and that might just be because uh, they may not include that until they get um, a really experimental, or I, I mean, a uh, really stable release. Uh, maybe uh, an RC or a release candidate. Um, 
so uh, you know maybe we just gotta hold off on that um, but other than that everything seems fine scrolling um, it's it's all been good um, I just want to mention a few things before I wrap up this video. Um, one, if, if you go, if you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Um, if you want to see more, just stay subscribed and I'll be making more. The reason why I've made less is because there's been less, uh, Im uh, not improve, but just less added features as they Im uh, improve the ROM. Um, but as I notice bugs and things like that, I'll go ahead and make a video. Uh, stay subscribed because I will be having a giveaway coming up. I know uh, it's been a while since I've been saying that, but I'm trying to gain uh, you know traction, let people know uh, there's a giveaway. That way I can make the video and I'll actually get views and people commenting. Um, and if you aren't already, you can go ahead and uh, add me on Google+. Plus. Follow me on Twitter because uh, I do update, update those um, regularly so that you guys can stay up to date. Uh, with things that you know I don't post a video for because it just might be a bit of information um, so go ahead and uh, check me out on those links will be in the description and if you have any questions or comments uh, just go ahead and like I said you can uh, uh, through Google Plus Twitter or YouTube comments or private messages whatever you guys need um, I'll go ahead and help you if it's phone related um, so thanks for that and I'll catch you in the next video